The Music Cares Map Benefit Fund was sort of a superstar jam for hard rock and heavy metal all-stars, all gathered around Ozzy Osbourne getting the Stevie Ray Vaughan Award. The seats were pricey for those in attendance, and although the Prince of Darkness wasn't able to talk with us, his drummer and Black Sabbath's live drummer, Tommy Clufetto, said that Ozzy was thrilled that the last event raised the most money in its existence. I know he's really happy. I think I've heard that... Um, this night has raised more money than any other night, so I know he, he heard that and I think that he's extremely happy and I think he's, he's really enjoying that he's getting a chance to give back and he's really excited and he's looking forward to getting on stage and I'm, I'm happy here to be here supporting him and uh, getting a jam behind him as always. The event featured Metallica, but it also featured Ozzy playing with Tommy, his bassist Blasco and an all-star group of musicians including Slash, Billy Morrison and Dave Navarro. Billy Morrison, now Billy Idol's guitarist, said he was intimidated by bandmate for the night, Blasco. He's intimidating, man. Let me, t let me tell you something about this dude, right? Like, there's a whole rock thing and the tattoo thing. When I got up with him for the sound check, for the rehearsal, this dude can play some bass guitar. So it's an honor to be playing with him and Tommy and Ozzy. It's fantastic. Jane's Addiction guitarist Dave Navarro played the Ozzy classics I Don't Know and Crazy Train with Morrison and Blasco, and he credited Osborne and Black Sabbath with him setting down the path to being a musician. Ozzy was one of my first introductions to heavy metal music, and uh, that kind of paved the way for the rest of my life. Had it not been for discovering Black Sabbath, it's likely I wouldn't have been a guitar player, and it's likely I wouldn't be down the path that I'm on and ultimately have the life I have. So. To give back with Ozzy in a situation like this, which, you know, I'm a recovering ex-addict. The MAP Fund seeks to help musicians in need with addiction recovery and other health-related problems. It was created because many musicians do not have health insurance, and many of those in attendance had friends and themselves saved by the organization.